Gotta learn from your losses, just the victory, baby. I've done it all and seen it all, it's just a victory, baby. You gotta see the silver line and it's a victory, baby. If it benefits I know, I know. Uh, if you want greatness, what's good team? It's your boy Cal with another one. Back with another one. For you, for those who don't know who I am, my name's Calvin. I'm a land bank expert in the Detroit Land Bank. Um purchased 13 properties from the Detroit Land Bank Authority um, and I show you guys how to get it and show you how I was been able to become successful buying these properties from the Detroit Land Bank so I know you guys are looking at this title and it's like what are you talking about Kevin what's going on right I'm talking for the this video is really for the people that have an uh, uh, the final walkthrough coming up or you have to reschedule your final walkthrough um, this is really for the raggly people. I ain't gonna lie to you. These are for the raggly people that sit here think y'all just about to get over on these good working people that got, that's just trying to do a job. Um, and you guys are trying to bribe them, um, giving them a hard time. Like, I ain't for the foolishness. And if you're gonna work with me, I ain't for the foolishness, right? Um, so let me, let me, uh, elaborate on this. So we have people out here that are, uh, giving the third party team, you know, giving them a hard time or whatnot, you know, if, if it's not scheduling the uh, final appointment or uh, you're not letting your, you're not there for your house, um, allowing access to your property. Now, as you all know, you sign a purchase agreement with the Detroit Land Bank Authority when you purchase your property, right? That agreement means you have to fulfill all obligations regarding that property so they can release their lien in the property if you do not fulfill that agreement that's a breach of contract where they take the property back so that final inspection that final walkthrough you know these people all they're there to do is to walk through your property take pictures of what you have in your property and send it to the land bank so that means you need to have running water in your property you need to have active heat and electricity in your property right we're not talking about taking uh borrowing water from the neighbor uh miss miss jackson next door and we got a water hose ran to your property we ain't talking about none of that foolishness you have to have a water meter some of this stuff is like you know self-explanatory y'all y'all do realize the detroit land bank is a government entity so anybody that's working for them uh in, in any capacity that's all up under the government umbrella so bribery is uh, against the law y'all do realize that right so and what i mean is is that hey i know i don't have a furnace yet but could you just take a picture or send them a picture of what you have or whatever and i get you a, a swarm you know what i'm saying i get you a couple gift cards you know what i'm saying or come by my shop or whatever it is yeah that is against the law like cut that foolishness out guys i don't understand it i don't understand it but I know it's not my subscribers. I know the people that's, you know, I know it's not y'all, but this is for the other people that's sitting here that may binge watch my videos that be on that scam and stuff. Stop trying to scam the land bank and get y'all stuff together, for real. Y'all got, it's too easy. Now it's not easy, but it's too, it's easier than the mortgage. It's, it's easier than that, trust me. You know, they give you all the tools for you to be successful and y'all need to utilize them, right? So, ducking and dodging, the final inspection team is not <laughs> in your best interest because if sh if they get fed up with you sitting here ducking and dodging them, you don't have time for them and stuff like this you know what they're going to tell you which you, you guys are lucky they don't tell you this the first time when you sit here and don't make time for them say okay well hey i'm just going to send it back to your compliance agent you're not being compliant now your house is now you lost your house and then you want to blame the land bank cut that stuff out dog like literally cut it out okay so let's get let's let's do what we're supposed to do be responsible adults and get this stuff done you know what i'm saying so you can move on to your next project because don't we want the land bank off our back i know we do okay so but also for my my subscribers i know y'all ain't out here doing all that foolishness and trying to scam the land bank i know y'all not doing that you know i just know you're not better not find you I'll kick you off the team real quick <laughs> but yeah um and for you people that may have took a picture you know, you know, maybe took a picture of something that's not in your property and now you're at the final inspection. Okay, things happen, you know. 
make sure you have your hot water tank and furnace in your property make sure you have all everything that's on that checklist that I went through in my previous videos and if you don't know what that is go watch my previous videos you'll know exactly what I'm talking about but let's stop the foolishness stop the scamming stop harassing these people and if you got a dog in your property when they come there to, to do the final inspection put your dang old dog up who do y'all want to get sued out here get, get your life together get 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 yeah that's for the people that's in here acting all acting like they ain't got their uh, life together yeah but anyway y'all have a good rest of y'all day and stay productive also i'll be dropping video with the walkthrough team um i have to take responsibility on this i totally forgot to let their boss know that i was going to be filming so i have to um they graciously um told me that um i'll be able to uh shadow them on a walkthrough so i can't upload that footage because of course it was my bad i didn't let their team know that i was going to be filming and we want to make sure everybody's comfortable being on film and whatnot so look for that video hopefully i'll be able to shoot that sometime next week uh a final inspection walkthrough um so i won't be sharing that but if you guys go on my my channel my last live that i shot um it it details everything that was going on in the uh final walkthrough and also to um tomorrow i'll be doing a live at eight o'clock i'm gonna try to keep to that time so if you want to tune in i'll be live on my channel so tune into that um also if you watch my video to the end i appreciate you and don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment um at the bottom of this video and if you're a scammer you leave a comment too and tell me and just, let's tell us about the little scamming stuff you was doing when they, when they was trying to come take pictures of, <laughs> of the property. <laughs> I'm cutting up today. But I love you guys. Uh, stay blessed.